Hi, this is Steve Jacobs with Apps for Android. In the next few minutes, I'm going to give a short demonstration of two ebook readers. One is Apps for Android's accessibility enhanced version of Cool Reader. The other, for all practical purposes, could be the Kindle, Nook, Sony Reader, or any other ebook reader that is not fully accessible to individuals with print disabilities. One exception is Apple's iPad, which can be used with VoiceOver to read ebooks. Roughly 10% of the U.S. population, or around 30 million consumers, have some type of print disability that precludes them from being able to use inaccessible ebook readers. Applying that percentage to the population of the world, we're talking about 650 million consumers. Add to that more than a billion people who never learn to read, and we're talking somewhere around 1.6 billion consumers who cannot make use of inaccessible ebook readers. First, let's look at the uh, features of the Android Kindle software running on a Samsung tablet. We'll be reading Pride and Prejudice. First, I'm going to uh, scroll over here and tap on the Kindle icon. And the book loads. It looks good. Uh, it's an elegant interface with quite a few features. I'll cover some of them. If you tap the top of the screen, you can tap that little half moon and change the background color of the book. You can go into night mode, much more legible. We'll go back to white. You can change the size of the font. We can make it bigger and of course smaller. There's a menu here. If I tap that you can add bookmarks, review bookmarks, you can go to a certain page or percentage into the book you can share your progress with somebody. It's quite fully featured. You turn the page by just touching the screen. Pretty simple, very useful, very accessible to individuals who do not have a print disability. You can go to different chapters and so on. Let's exit the Kindle and We'll now, in the next segment of the video, look at Cool Reader reading Pride and Prejudice. And now let's take a look at the same book using the enhanced version of Cool Reader. One difference you'll notice immediately if I tap the bottom of the screen. He had always intended. It was then disclosed in the following manner, observing his second daughter employed in trimming a hat. He suddenly addressed her. It will read the book to you. Will like it. it will highlight the sentences the as they're the being read. Said her mother resentfully. Since we are we'll let this go for a little event. while. Mama, said Elizabeth, that we shall meet him at the assemblies, and that Mrs. Long promised to introduce him. I do not. And I'll stop the speech. That is the big difference. This ebook reader is accessible to people with print disabilities because the text is being read to the individual. The text is being highlighted to reinforce and to identify the text that is being read. You can, of course, do all the other things with Cool Reader, the enhanced version, that you can with the Kindle and much more. We can turn the pages. We can go backwards and forwards. We can enlarge the font. We can make the font smaller. We can toggle through reading modes. Sentence reading mode. 
So in sentence reading mode, we can read one sentence at a time or read one sentence continually, which continuously reads the book. And you cycle through these uh, different levels of reading, Word reading mode. by touching the center. Mode. We can go into night mode. The book becomes more legible or switch out of night mode or we can go to the table of contents, go to a chapter. As I'd mentioned before, you can turn the pages. How about dimming the screen a little bit or making it brighter? Let's see, what haven't I covered? Uh, there are in all 33 different commands that control a book. There are nine invisible quadrants on the screen. It's easy to identify all nine by running your finger along the edge and gauging where you are. Books can be read in 25 languages using high quality text-to-speech voices. And there are over 40 different voices available. So you can see that this uh, ebook reader is accessible, usable, and useful to approximately 1.6 billion more consumers than the first ebook reader. Also, keep in mind that you are looking at a real ebook reader, not a mock up, beta, or an engineering prototype. Well, that's the demo for today. We'll be releasing the accessible version of Cool Reader uh, very shortly, and I hope you have enjoyed the demo. Thanks for your time.